Well, good, wonderful, beautiful morning party. And Memphis, you look so proper. Are you waiting for something to happen? She's like, no, nah, I'm just chilling in the shade because I'm beautiful. We're going to go check on the baby birds. I was just back there and the mom and dad aren't around anywhere. Hi, you fluffy land cloud. Hello. <laughs> so we're going to go check on the birds and see what they look like. So there's the nest. Oh yeah, they're doing good. They're all waiting for their snack from mama. And she wasn't she's, around and now she's back. She, she's right up there. She's like, I got food, get out of the way. Alright. <laughs> oh, neighbor dog is out. Everybody's got to play with neighbor dog through the fence. I'm not, do you know what neighbor dog's name is? I want to say it's like Molly or Maxine or something. I think it starts... I heard her calling her the other day and I'm like, ah, oh, we need to figure out what Neighbor Dog's name is. And if you're wondering, Neighbor Dog that they play with belongs to the people that live behind us. Their property actually comes this way and then goes that way. Memphis, are you playing with Neighbor Dog? She's like, I love Neighbor Dog, guys. It's the best kind of dog to play with. They can't come at me, but I can play through the fence. <laughs> Kira's like, what, what the heck? What was that? Oh, she didn't fall for it that time. Oh, there's a bug. You get a bug, huh? You so get a bug. The neighbors have chickens, and Jamie was making the chicken sound, and Kira was like, wait, is there a chicken in our yard again? We have another yard chicken? <laughs> what did you say the chickens are talking to you? What did you find? Did you really find a bug. bug. I don't know if you guys can hear that, but the chickens in the yard are now talking to Jamie. When did you get as tall as Kira? I'm pretty sure she's shoulder height, same height as Kira. We do know that she is half a pound bigger than Kira as of yesterday. So, oh man, goodness me. You're gonna be a tank, do you know that? She's like, oh yeah, I'm a tank. Have you seen me? Have you seen me? I'm a tank. Hi, come on, let's go, 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 let's go! Yeah, you tell her. Say, get out of my way. It's going to be a warm one today, which means we'll probably go swimming later. Well, not you. You'll stand on your platform and on your floaty and be all happy as can be, but those two will probably swim. What do you think? You got something on your nose. Can I get it off? Hey, can I get that off your nose? Hey, you got something on your nose. I think it's a flower. Come on, let's go. Yes! So it's like, yep, back inside my ACs and my comfy couch uh, makes me happy. I don't know if this is vlog worthy, but some little critter just ran through the yard. We're going to see if we can catch it on camera. Okay. I don't know if this was a mouse or a shrew. And we don't even know if it's still here, but it was like right here. It's just gone. It's just gone. We caught a critter. Is he a mouse? It kind of looks like a mouse. Hi. Here, let's put you in the shade so my camera picks you up. There we go. Hi, buddy. I don't know how we managed to catch you. You're supposed to be faster than that. So Jamie and I were sitting eating lunch. We saw this cute little dude run across the yard and then he just stopped. I was afraid that he was dead or something. And I came out here and he didn't move. So I freaked out. Jamie went and got gloves on and picked him up. And uh, he's definitely not dead. <laughs> he's so cute. Can we keep him? <laughs> Oh my gosh, you're adorable. I'm pretty sure you're, I think you're right. I think he's a little field mouse. Hi, buddy. Oh, you're not a pet mouse, are you? I hope not. You look so fluffy. You're so fluffy. Why do all the animals come to us? Yeah, I don't know. Probably not the greatest yard to eat. Yeah, you're lucky we caught you before letting the dogs out here after lunch. Oh yeah. He doesn't seem very scared. I don't know what we're gonna do with you, but you're in a box. I might call my friend Michelle and see if she wants to come pick you up take you to her critter rehab place, but I don't know if she takes mice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but you're so cute! I could put you in a cage and keep you. Well, today got interesting. We caught a little mouse friend. Oh, you're cute. Sit up for me. Yeah, look how cute you are. Yeah, you're adorable. I know, you want out. You just, you don't want to get out in this yard. Trust me. So I think what I'm going to do, because we don't want them coming back in our yard, I think I'm going to close them up in this box and take them for a little ride and let them go in the woods. What do you think, dude? I know a lot of people are like, it's just a mouse, but look at him. He's so cute. Look at how cute his little face is. Yeah, want to go for a ride with me? We'll drop you off somewhere. Sounds like a plan. So a bunch of you have probably already corrected me in the comments, but I Google Lens him and it says he's a vole. An eastern pine vole, V-O-L-E, so he's not actually a mouse. 
You are really cute though. All right, dude, let's go for a little ride. Okay, so I think I said he was an Eastern Pine Vole. I think he's actually a Woodland Vole because the other one apparently is native to Europe. You're, oh, you're giving yourself a little bath? You're like, lady, you said you were taking me for a ride. Take me for a ride. And if you thought I was kidding, I was not. He's inside this box. We're gonna go drop him off a couple miles from here in the woods. This looks like a perfect new home for this little dude. Hey, little dude. Here we go. I'm tipping your box down. Three, two, one, go. You're free. You forgot to leave the box. Hey, I like you too. I'd keep you around, but you gotta, like, you're free. You can go. You don't have to stay here. You get a whole new home. Check it out. Look how cool it is. Go on. Hi, box, little dude. There you go. And there he goes. Yeah, see, that could be your new home. Bye, friend. It was nice to meet you. Thanks for coming to hang out. <laughs> they're like, well, what's going on out here? We totally want to figure it out. And then they're like, oh, never mind. There's a hose. It's way more fun than whatever mom was playing with. All right. I dropped him off in the woods. Mm -hmm. He gets a new chance at life. I told him not to come back here. Right. So hopefully he'll listen. Oh, my gosh. Don't get all wet. Oh, girls. They're like, but the hose! Apparently I have the sound on my phone, it keeps going off. Memphis, don't you want to play with the hose? She's like, um, no, that's puppy stuff. <laughs> get it, Eleanor, get it! Yes! <laughs> Alright, you girls gotta eat lunch, like, real soon here. Yeah, it's almost time for lunch. Ready? You hungry? Like, um, no, hose is better than food. <laughs> Greatest, the greatest game. Lunch time. So, you'll notice Memphis doesn't have her standard bowl. Because we don't really know what's going on with her right now, one of the things the vet suggested we do is make her food a little bit softer, just so it doesn't aggravate her throat. Again, we still don't know what's wrong, so we don't know if it's gonna help, but I've been moistening Memphis's food, and she really likes it. I actually think I'm gonna start doing it with all the dogs anyway. I'm gonna switch up their food a little bit again. You guys know I do that all the time. So I think I'm going to switch them up a little bit and start doing this with all their food. But Memphis really seems to enjoy it. She's like, this is great. Good stuff, girly. She's like, good stuff. Good stuff. Can I have some more? You can have some more later. Oh, and also, remember like quite a few vlogs ago we told you Eleanor went into heat? Well, she only had like three days of, you know, the stuff. And then a couple of days ago, she actually went into her actual heat. So if you see her wearing her diaper, that is why. <laughs> So quick story, we're gonna be gone for Jamie's birthday and I had something made for his birthday and it's getting delivered right now and he has no idea. So I'm gonna go get it and then we're gonna surprise him together. Okay, so we're not gonna be home for your birthday. You're right. Well, and we're having game night tomorrow. Right. So you get your tomorrow. birthday gift like two weeks early. Okay. So if you guys don't know, Jamie's birthday is August 1st. <laughs> so we're gonna take you out front. All right. And you get your birthday gift. No, it's not a car. <laughs> right, here, now I'll be blinded. <laughs> Blinded by the light. What? <laughs> Look at what Jamie got. Wow. Aren't those cool? Somebody did some good work. I told you you'd have no idea. So yeah. Wow. So look at they've got a scoreboard on the top, and the pegs are inside. So yeah. Oh, and there's like little drink holders on there. <laughs> if you can fit them under there. Yeah. But yeah, they turned out pretty cool, huh? They're pretty neat. Yeah, you had no idea. So I got Jamie cornhole boards. Since we play it a lot in the summertime for game night. And those are official size, unlike our camping size ones right. that we have. You also get new bags, official type bags. But he was going to do charcoal and red. But he didn't have any of the red fabric, so he'll bring me those another time. Surprise! You surprised me. I was... did! <laughs> That's pretty good. Now I want to play with him. Uh, yeah, okay, we can go in the backyard and play with him. Or tomorrow. Or tomorrow. Or we'll today. do that too. Either way. Ma'am, it took you like two seconds to get on this side of the fence. And you're going to jump in the pool, aren't you? He's like, you can't keep me out. Oh, you didn't jump in, just feet wet? Eleanor's like, hmm, maybe we should get into the pool. You're going to get in the pool tomorrow. You don't have to get in the pool today. I mean, I'm getting in the pool today because it's hot, but you could just get in tomorrow. Where's Ms. Memphis? Come here, Memphis. Come here, babe. She's like, no, you're going to put me in the pool. No, thank you. I'm leaving. I'm out. Bye. I was just going to put you on your bed. 
I don't think she believes me. <laughs> oh, and she's in. <laughs> You're my little fish dog. Oh, you've almost got the Kira tail going. Almost. Almost. Are you getting in, Kira? She's like, I always think about it. Yeah? Eleanor has figured out how to float well. Look at it, she's doing so good. She's figured out how to maneuver slow or fast. You really caught on to swimming pretty darn quick, pupper. Oh, you want me to put that in the water for you? I can put that in the water for you. Hold on. I'll get it in there for you. And I can put the platform in while this dog just swims. Memphis is like, it's so nice right here. Oh, yeah, this nice and cool. Yeah. You could be laying on this nice bed over here. But you're just like, no way, man. This is the spot. You got your fresh water there. Oh, laying right here. Crazy. Are they going nuts? <laughs> Eleanor's got her robe on. <laughs> she doesn't even care. I know. Nope. She's like, I can still run. Even with this robe on, I'm going to catch you, Kira. <laughs> Just don't let her back in the pool. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you goofy dogs. Jamie brought his boards out. It's not game night. I know. Had to practice, right? Oh, is that what it is? Right. Wow. Close. Oh. Yeah, I need to practice. Do they feel different? Like, I don't know how to explain yes, that. It, it, the, yes. Oops. That was pretty good. Yeah. Yeah, I'll zoom in on this. Here you go. Yeah, it feels different when it lands. Yeah. It's way sturdier. Yeah, it right. doesn't bounce. That's what I noticed. Like, the bags don't, or that's the board doesn't to, bounce. Yeah, that's what I was trying to practice, see if I can get some that land on the edge. They should Right. Off, right. You know, unless they stay on, but then you know, they hit the edges. Fun! It'll, this will be so fun. <laughs> Eleanor still has her robe on. Check it out. Look out, Eleanor! Oh. Almost. So close. Almost. <laughs> that was a miss. Are you digging and throwing rocks? Yeah. Of course. Well, what's your review? I like them. Yeah? Very nice. Yay! And you had no idea. Happy two weeks until your birthday. <laughs> you gonna have your fit? You, gonna, you wanna throw a pillow off the couch or something? Have your fit? Eleanor's like, I, I got a diaper on, but I'm like, okay, we'll go this way. So apparently there's some tall ships downtown. So tonight for the dog's walk, we're going downtown to see the ships. So we were on our way down to uh, go see the boats and we realized the city band was playing. So we decided to start our walk right here. And we get to listen to the fun music. This is our Alpina city band. They play every Thursday night. And it's people that were like in band in high school, but they still want to play band. So they practice together and they come do concerts here every Thursday night. There's a dog over there looking at us. <laughs> the dogs are like, yes! <laughs> oh, there's a pupper. Come on. Come on. Good girl. They're singing with the music. And they're there, playing in a band. Well, this is a good evening for this. Eleanor's like, this is so fun. I've never been here before. That's a lie. You've been here. You've got your dog training stuff done right over there. <laughs> These two are like, we've been to this park before. It's super fun. Come on, pupper. I know you're so excited. It's so exciting. So many, many years ago when we actually lived closer to downtown, I used to come down here almost every Thursday with the dogs and walk around just to listen to the music. It's so cool. All right, let's go see if we can see some tall ships. So we made it to the river. And you guys ready for this? Is that the Black Pearl? <laughs> that first one looks like a pirate ship. Yeah, that first one's pretty cool. I mean, all three are really cool. So the tall Keep ships going. are here for the Tall Ship Festival. You can pay money to ride on them. You can pay money to tour them, or you can just look at them from here, Uh huh. which is, I mean, we're gonna go get a little bit closer, but because of where the sun was at, we wanted to film them from this side. What are you gonna sing in them ships? <laughs> like, well, we're just excited to be walking somewhere different. <laughs> like, this is great, we love it. Check it out. That's a pretty good view. And then that's the, the shipwreck tours boat. Oh, are we getting in the river? Yeah. 
Right. Okay, I was getting in the river. Careful, because if you go too far that way, you'll fall in. So we're almost to the little bridge that we're crossing. I used to bike up and down here with Shelby all these years ago when we lived here. Check out this swan. He's so big. He's like, I'm just eating my dinner. So we are at Island Mill Park. Many, many years ago. I guess it wasn't that many years ago. I used to bring Shelby down here to go swimming. You could bring the kayak down here. Remember when we used to come here in Pokemon Go all the time? Yes. Oh, now you want to pull out your phone in Pokemon Go, don't you? No. Are you sure? You're here. I could just go. You could. <laughs> okay, that's a pretty cool view. I like this, this spot right here. I feel like I'm telling all the stories. My brother and his wife did wedding photos right here on this bridge. And then we did photos, we did family photos, I believe, on this bridge as well. This is the bridge that they built. So you can walk across from Rotary Park over to the Noah building. Well, we thought we could walk closer on this side, but they got the bike path all blocked off. So we can't get close to the ships. So we gotta go this way, but they're right there. If we were in pirate clothing, we could. Oh, we have to be in pirate clothing? Yeah. To be in period attire? Yes. All right. We'll walk this way through the Fletcher Walmart Depot Man. building. This is the old Fletcher paper mill. Now I feel like I can make one of those videos for the abandoned YouTube channels. Look, we can get in that window right there. Just boost me up, hon. All right. <laughs> 1898 this building was built. It was the old Fletcher paper mill. It's such a cool building. I want to go inside it, but not allowed. They're like, ooh, something right there smells pretty good. It's crazy that there were blocks behind it. I know, there's bricks there. Look, that window's open. Boost me through that window. <laughs> Oh wait, look, there's a hole right there. I can totally fit. Well, that turned out to be a pretty fun-filled day. Was that fun? You fun on your walk, and you got to you got petted by all kinds of people. And now, we're gonna call the night and go to bed. So we hope you guys enjoyed today's video. As always, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive, dream big. We will see you again soon. I have to get the treats out of here, otherwise you're not gonna believe me. Ready? Go to bed. All of you, go. Go to bed. Good night, audience.